Listen what I say, oh. I got your hey, oh. Now Red Hot Chili Peppers as we get real close to 10 o'clock on this Monday morning. You know, Mom's Day going to be here before mm -hmm. you know it. And there's a place here in the Valley that opens early just for the occasion. Let's check in with Heidi. She's at Nook Kitchen in downtown Phoenix where she's getting a look at what they'll be serving. Good morning. Hey, good morning, you guys. In the 8 o'clock hour, we showed you all of the great food options that they're going to be serving up for their once-a-year brunch. You're going to score major brownie points with Mom if you bring her down here. Not that moms keep track of that, but we kind of do. But once you're inside here, this place is gorgeous. If you have never been down here, my gosh, they have this beautiful wine wall. If uh, you want more brownie points, put one of those in Mom's house. And then they have a, a really great location. We're at Central in Monroe, right in the heart of downtown Phoenix. They have a great patio. This is the time of year to get out there and enjoy it. And maybe, I don't know, have a cocktail or two. My man Dustin here is shaking one up for us this morning. What are you fixing? Uh, this is called the Chele. The Chele. What's in it? Uh, El Silencio Espadine Mezcal okay. with honey lavender, fresh juice sycama, lime. Sounds good. Aquafago. Sounds light and cool. Just what mom wants. Go ahead and finish it up. You already yeah. shook it. Now you're straining it. It's beautiful. Your cocktails on Mother's Day. Anything special or are these ones that you guys serve all the time? Well, we will be serving our normal menu. Um, okay. We probably will have some sort of special brunch cocktail that I make that morning. To be to be continued, right? You'll come so, up yes. with that. Okay, um, what is that that you're putting This is in? aquafaba. It's the brine from garbanzo beans. Okay. A little more shaking. You guys are always, you've got great rhythm here. Uh, reservations are booking up for Mother's Day. They've already had a few phone calls since our last segment. So if this is something that you think mom would enjoy, do not wait till the last minute and be sure you order her maybe one of these or maybe one of the other ones that you have. Talk to me about your reconstructed mule. You say Moscow Mule's most popular drink in the country right it now. It is, it is. Um, our reconstructed mule has, is this one right here, by the way, because it doesn't look anything like a regular mule. Has fig vodka, ginger syrup, bitters, lime, strawberry lime foam, and black peppercorn on top. And I love it. He said, uh, the, his boss said, you have to have a mule. He said, I'm going to do it my way. So that's his. Of course, mimosas. What's this beauty right here? That's called On the Spritz, and it's a uh, re redone typical uh, Aperol spritzer. All right. And then, you know what? You can't go wrong with the Bloody Mary for mom. Always a good idea. Get her down here, treat her to brunch. It is once a year. So from these mama's boys to you, Scott Passmore, because I know you're one too, and I think Tess has a couple of her own. <laughs> We're going to put all the information for you on and, our website. We'll send and, it back to you guys. And Heidi, you just happen to be a mom, and it's almost 10 o'clock, which means it's 5 o'clock somewhere, so have fun. Someone's got to taste those You drinks. know what? Yeah, let's wrap this up. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Heidi.